Hey, it's Scott Kubo. So Tesla Autopilot uses forward-facing cameras to detect lane lines. And a lot of people have asked, how well does it perform when driving directly into the sun? So let's find out. So we've got uh, Navigate on Autopilot engaged. So in addition to lane keeping, uh, the car will follow its GPS navigation and make lane changes as needed. It's doing fine staying within the lines, no problem here. And even though we're going kind of directly into the sun, you can still clearly see the lane line to the left and kind of to the right. Now Autopilot wants to make a lane change. We confirm that by tapping down on the stock and it starts to do it, but then it cancels. It has a message there saying canceled. It wants to change lanes again, tapping down on the stock to confirm. And nope, just doesn't do it. Uh -huh. So it seems to be having difficulty with automatic lane changes. There's no other vehicles around, so I don't think it's because there's a, it detects a vehicle in the way. There, finally is able to, no, whoa, that is weird. Possibly because of the bright sunlight, really is getting confused, but I'm not going to uh, keep doing this. So we can click on the camera icon to save a video clip using the built-in dash cam feature and that uses the narrow field or long range camera. And here's the three cameras here. There's also a medium field camera as well as a fisheye or wide angle lens camera in the middle. Now let's superimpose the dash cam footage onto our scene so we'll get some approximation of what the car might be seeing. Uh, you can see that the gain is uh, turned down quite a bit so that the bright sun doesn't wash out the image. And so the overall image is being optimized and the cars and horizon are very visible, but it's kind of suppressing and darkening uh, the surface of the road. So you can see that it's kind of difficult to see the lane lines of the uh, adjacent lane to the right and that may be the problem that's happening. Autopilot needs to visually verify the lane lines of the adjacent lane and that check might not be occurring until the lane change is actually initiated. So possibly it'll start the lane change because it see the dash line to its right and it knows which lane it's in due to the maps. But I wish it would uh, do that verification check of the adjacent lane before starting move. Or maybe um, there's some other thing that's causing uh, Autopilot to abort. So here is uh, a newer version, 2019.5. Here it's taking the exit on its own, and that worked very well despite the really bright sun straight in one's eyes. And here we've got a merging situation. So far, so good. Uh, Navigate on autopilot wants to change lanes to get behind this truck. Blind spot uh, warning and then it's clear and it gets, geez, halfway over and then tries to go back uh, to the left so I had to take over. Re-engage autopilot here and now the sun's off a little to the left and it does this lane change uh, just fine. So when the sun is just right, uh, lane changing can still be problematic. Now let's bring up the dash cam footage and with a recent update we can now see footage from the side rearward facing cameras. And Maybe there was some glare or some object in the blind spot that caused autopilot to uh, cancel that lane change. So here it looks like the lane lines are well identified, takes this fork very well, pretty good visualization of the lane lines here. And even if the sun were to completely block view of the vehicles, the radar is completely unaffected by the sunlight and can still localize those uh, cars. So it uh, sees a vehicle in the blind spot and you see the red warning on the screen. And then as that vehicle clears, blind spot looks clear. I guess you could say that the adjacent lane lines weren't very clear and maybe 
that's why I canceled. And it's not good the way it uh, aborts suddenly and swerves back. If you have thoughts on what might be causing the problem or how Tesla could teach Autopilot to compensate for this edge issue, let me know in the comments. And for now, don't use Autopilot when driving directly into the sun. But if you leave uh, later in the day, you might uh, capture a brilliant sunset uh, like this one. Quite beautiful uh, with the sky all red and orange. It can make for uh, quite a pleasant uh, evening commute. I think Elon Musk would want you to imagine that you're in the future riding in a self-driving car on a highway on the planet Mars. Something interesting that I recently learned though is that on Earth the sunsets are red, but on Mars the sky is red during the day and the sunsets are actually blue. So it's the opposite as it is on Earth. Anyhow, uh, I enjoyed having you along. Uh, if you enjoyed this video and found it informative, please give it a like. Uh, subscribe if you uh, want to see more videos. I hope you have a really great day and see you in the next one. Thank you.